Hello YouTube and welcome to my review of my jailbroken iPad 3. What you need to be aware of before you jailbreak your iPad are two to three main points. Number one and number two are that it'll make your iPad more glitchy, not much more, but you'll notice it. And number two is that it will make your iPad a little slower, not much, but you'll notice it again. And the third is, if you find a sketchy website claiming to jailbreak your iPad, and like a sucker, you click OK and let it download, you are probably going to get a virus on your computer. Don't do that. Ask around. Find a friend. Go on YouTube. I'll leave some good jailbreakers in the description. But it's not worth getting a broken computer over, okay? Now... As you can see here, my scrolls have been tweaked. Uh, my background, well, you, anybody can change that, but um, I have iFile, I have Cydia, I have Installus, and I have Settings, Activator, all that good stuff. Now, having a jailbroken iPad 3, um, there's always a hacker on a game who hacks the game and has a million points and such and so what I'm gonna do is show you what most of you if you're thinking about jailbreaking think you're gonna get okay the stash look at my stash guys okay I don't know if you can see it so I'll bring it in close 12 million two thousand four hundred and three coins and I've started playing this game about a couple hours ago that is because I have a jailbroken iPad 3. Now, all of you are going to be probably be hating on me, me and be like, cheater, 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 I hate you. And, and you know the people on all the leaderboards who have maxed out their scores? I guarantee you 99% of those people jailbroke their iPads, iPhones, iPods, whatever. Now, I want to show you guys some of the fun stuff you can do that's kind of basic but I still like it so this is the settings mode that you get with my particular jailbroken iPad 3 with um, my software I downloaded so you get the normal settings then you get your extensions which is uh, gravity board barrel activator winter board so let me show you what barrel does so you can do mode I'll just do carousel or carousel. Okay. And I will exit and I will now slide and slide and it's carousel. So barrel is going to allow you to change how you transition from here to here like that, okay? Now if you go on Cydia, you'll find a whole huge thing of tw of tweet of tweaks and themes and things and I mean you I don't even know what some of these things are okay but if you go into if we go into installed here you can see that I have activator I have barrel so these are all the tweaks I did now what I what I'm not actually going to do uh, reviews on individual tweaks unless you guys ask me to. You can PM me if you want to. But I will do a review on having it overall. So I have a lot of paid games like Asphalt 7 here. That's $5. I did not pay one penny. And I've actually only played it once and I'm a level 7. And, um,. <laughs> Things like that are the result. And I think it actually takes away from your experience of an iPad. I don't usually use my iPad 3 jailbroken anymore. I don't, like, the only jailbreaking features I use are the themes and barrel and activator and such. But what you're going to get out of it is um, free games. And now, getting free games is a tweak. It's not like an actual automatic thing that comes with your software. Alright, so...
Alright, uh, so the main point here is that if you get the tweak, anything you want on the Apple Store can be yours. I am talking about anything here. To show you what I mean, I will show you things I have downloaded. I thought I downloaded iReplo I Pro here. If I don't, I will show you guys me downloading Ira Pro. If you don't know what that is, that is a like 900 something dollar app, I believe, that I am going to be downloading for free so that you will believe me. I don't know what the actual name is, it's really weird. Uh, but if I type this in, it'll work. I think. And no. No, 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 no. No. Okay, but the main point is anything you want, you can just download for free. Anything you want. Like, I can just find random apps that you'd have to pay for, scroll down, and download them. So, I'll pick a game, like, um, any one of these. So, like, Need for Speed Hot Pursuit, download, uploading.com, yeah, this is my software, now, I'll do uploading.com. Submit. E. Now, what you need to know about jailbreaking is depending on your software, you're, but with most people's, you're probably going to have to do these before you download apps, which is very, 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 very annoying. I get super duper annoyed having to do that when I download my apps. And that's why I don't download many anymore. And um, I used to buy them, delete them, throw them around like they were nothing. And then I actually kind of wanted to go on my Apple ID account. And that's something you give up with this, okay? I mean, uh, the overall experience is better, but there's just a lot of trade-offs. So my advice to you is... um. Watch some YouTube videos, go on Google, and um, if, if you know any friends that have done it, really ask around if you know a friend who's done it. Try theirs out. That's what I did. Because at the end of the, d the day, you're going to get a lot of cool features that Apple wouldn't give you, but you're going to have to trade away a lot of stuff for them as well. So... Yeah, it's kind of, it's your choice in the end, but I would actually recommend it to my friends. I found it very helpful, and um, when I was like, when I was running low on money, and I wanted to buy new apps, and I wanted my music, I was able to buy it, but I, if you're, if you're on the fence about this, I discourage you to do this, because once you do it, it's going to be pretty complex to unjailbreak if you don't know what you're doing. And so, basically, I would recommend this to someone who, who just, who's got their heart set on jailbreaking their iPad. Alright, that's who I would recommend it to. But overall, I think you'll have a better using experience than you would with a normal iPad. And, yeah, it's, all in all, I think it's better than it was before, once it's jailbroken. And now, I'm sorry, you guys are probably going to kill me for this, but I forgot who I jailbroke with, but, um, when I look it up on my computer, I will write it in the description for you, I promise. Uh, it, write a million comments and hold me, and hold me to that, because I am forgetful, but... Yeah, that's having a jailbroken iPad for you in a nutshell. Okay, guys, thanks.